Hello and welcome to Monday's Aussie Results Update. Carsten Ball has won his first ATP Challenger title over the weekend in Lexington. Ball was too strong for American Jesse Levine in the final, winning 6-4, 7-6. It sees Ball move up to a new career-high ranking of world number 108. Davis Cup coach Todd Woodbridge says Ball is one of several informed players that could be selected in Australia's team to take on Belgium in September. A wonderful result this past week with Carsten Ball uh, winning in Lexington. He was a semi the week before. He lost to Marinko Potosovic, who won that event. So that's two Aussie wins in challenges in the United States in the past fortnight. So those guys are really starting to uh, cement themselves. There's further good news for our Davis Cup team with Chris Guccione back on the winner's list. The big serving lefty won through to the final round of qualifying for this week's ATP event in Los Angeles with a hard fought win over American Ryan Harrison. Nick Lindahl is also one win away from reaching the main draw after downing Jamie Baker. Jess Moore was the best performing Australian woman on the ITF circuit last week. She reached the semi finals of an ITF $25,000 event in France. Moore for one win short of reaching the final, going down to the top seed. Olivia Rogowska and Tammy Patterson both reached the quarterfinals in Great Britain, while Tiffany Welford reached the final eight in Canada. Coming up this week, Sam Stoza begins her US hardcourt campaign at the Bank of West Classic in Stanford. Stoza is the top seed at this week's event and has been granted a first round bye. She's still awaiting her second round opponent. Anastasia Rodianova and Yamila Groth are both in action at the Istanbul Cup. Groth faces German Annalena Gronfeld first up. On the ATP circuit, Peter Luchak meets German Daniel Brands in the first round of the Swiss Open in Gustard. Nick Lindahl plays Tim Smyzek for a spot in the main draw in LA. Chris Guccione plays American wildcard Steve Johnson. Four Aussies are in action at a challenger in Canada, including Adam Feeney, who won through qualifying. And Rami's Junaid is the sole Aussie in action in Finland. That's all we've got time for today. Stay with us all week on tennis.com.au. Each day we'll bring you the latest Aussie results.